Hi, I'm Craig. I swallow two AAA batteries every morning to charge myself, and this is Mental Floss Video. Today I'm going to answer Spadiroll's big question, where do the naming conventions for batteries come from? AAA, AA, D, etc., and why no B batteries? Let's get started. Bzz. Sorry. I burped. <laughs> The word battery and the concept of a battery have been around for a long time, but for our purposes, the first real one was invented in 1800, and by 1836, a practical battery had been developed that could help people in their day-to-day -day lives. It took a while before people decided that there needed to be a standard for battery sizes and characteristics. They needed a way for all manufacturers to make similar batteries so that they'd be similarly compatible with various electronics. Tell that to the phone companies with their stupid charger cords. There are actually multiple standards organizations that do this type of thing. There's the International Electrotechnical Commission, my nickname in high school, which is an international organization that comes up with standards for tons of technologies, including power generation, solar energy, and you guessed it, batteries. The IEC was formed in 1906, and they're the ones responsible for the battery naming conventions that many countries use today, but not the ones that Spadiro was talking about. IEC batteries have names like R6 or R03, which are AA and AAA respectively. In the US, standardization happened around World War I, when the manufacturers collaborated with the War Industries Board and a couple of other government agencies. In the 1920s, an organization called the National Standards Institute jumped in to name the different types of batteries, and they went in alphabetical order, so there were A batteries, B batteries, C batteries, and so on. Eventually, smaller batteries were invented, so they were given AA and AAA. The American National Standards Institute has since replaced the National Standards Institute. Now they're responsible for keeping batteries standard in the US. And they're also really boring at naming things. And as for why there are no B batteries, there actually are. You just don't often see regular A or B batteries anymore because AA and AAA are way more convenient. C and D still have a space on the market, but we don't have much of a use for A or B anymore. It's, we're ending on a sad note here. Jeez. Thanks for watching Mental Floss Video, which is made with the help of all of these A or B batteries. If you have a big question of your own that you'd like answered, leave it below in the comments. See you next time. Just kidding. Yeah, we have a use for you guys. You're not A or B. You're like you're you're AAA in my book. <laughs>